Does this new invention live up to the hype? The kids post. Hey guys, well, you might have seen this new Dyson supersonic hairdryer advertised around town or going crazy on social media. So when the opportunity came to give it a try, I jumped at the chance. I unfortunately have been blow drying my hair pretty much since I was 11 because I've got naturally very curly frizzy hair which well you can't see right now but give it a few minutes and I start to look like a poodle. So when it comes to hair dryers I'm all over it but they've pretty much been the same since forever until now. Dyson have reinvented the hair dryer and since they invested 50 million pounds into developing it went through 600 prototypes and sell it for 700 Aussie dollars. I wanted to see what it was all about. And so did a lot of mums in our mums Facebook group. So let's have a look at it. Let's see what you get. So they come with a number of attachments. The first one I'm gonna show you is the wider one, which they call the smoothing nozzle. And what I love about this is that they attach magnetically. So there's no fiddling around. Often with my other hairdryer that I've been using, it hasn't been known for the parts to fall off. So this is great, because that's not gonna happen. This one is the narrow one, which is the styling concentrator. It also comes one second, with a diffuser. For those of you that want volume and curl your hair, and just while I'm here, I'll show you. It comes with a non slip mat, which you open up, and a little storage hanger and an, um, an instruction booklet. So now that I've plugged it in, let me show you the actual device. So you've got your on and off button here, and a cooling button down there. And here you've got four different heat settings and three different speed settings. And the other big difference with this hairdryer compared to other hairdryers, like I'll just show you what I normally use. This is my Parlax, which is looking very worn and torn, but that's what I normally use. And the motor for normal hairdryers is up here where the air comes in here and comes out there. The Dyson one is very different. The motor is actually in the handle, so it feels very different to the hairdryers that we're used to already before I've even turned it on. It's, it, it feels completely different. Okay, so let's give it a go. I'm going to start with the wider nozzle and just dry um, half my hair and see what it's like. You ready? Here we go. Oh, it's so cool. It feels very different to a normal hair dryer. The sound is a little bit different. It's a bit quieter, um, but it just feels really different. Like there's not such a pull on your whole arm. I'm just going to dry one side and we've got a little bit dry while we're filming but I will do one side properly and then we'll have a look at the difference but it, it really feels it is, it's a very different feel to normal hair dryers I'm going to change the nozzle in a sec okay let's change it to the other one you know what's great actually because this it's not hot to the touch normally if I try and change it an attachment or it falls off and I put it back on my head it's really hot because that's not hot at all so let's put the narrow one on and then I'm gonna get my hairbrush my old favorite here's what it looks like and start drying a bit properly and see how it looks I have to say there's a lot of force coming out but it doesn't feel like it and it's drying really quickly uh, and one thing I really loved about when I was reading about this hair dryer is that they spent so much time and money in making sure that the technology put into it doesn't damage your hair and that, that's a huge win because if you're like me and you go over your hair every day even if you don't wash it every day and you, but you still go over it in the morning with a dryer the no damage effect um, is a real bonus
Okay, so I've done half my hair and it's smooth and straight and that was really quick to be honest. It really was. Um, I'm going to do the other half, do the whole hair and then I'm going to tell you what I really think about this hair dryer. So I'm all done. My hair is dry, very dry and smooth and that was super fast. I have to say my verdict, it's definitely faster than the hair dryers that I've used before. There's no doubt about that. A couple of other things I do love about this um, that you can just pull on, on and off the attachments really easily. They don't get hot and they don't fall off. Also, um, there's no grill at the back of this hair dryer where sometimes your hair can get caught in um, the back. I love that you know the money invested in inventing this did go into um, ensuring that it does the least amount of damage to your hair because if you're like me and you're blow drying your hair every day, even if it's for a few seconds in the morning to go over it or after a big wash, then that's really important. Um, I also, you know, the weight of it, it is a different experience. It's just a, a totally different new hair dryer. The price tag, well, that is where the issue comes in. Um, but I have to say, I am a big fan of this. You can buy one at David Jones Meyer or on the Dyson website. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more episodes. Thanks.